Hello people and welcome back to Sevtech. And looking around here, I mean you probably can tell uh, what time of year that this video is being shot by the the chest changing, the default chest changing to uh, boxes with wrapping. Well anyway, so keep on moving forward with what we're doing as we dolge into this new age of age three. I got the coke oven going and um, let it run a batch. So it's fill up with creosote now. So we should be able to move forward with these uh, some of these levels here and keep pushing forward. And I did a little like a little exploring in the nether to get that situated so we can go in and out of there nicely. So we should be able to take buckets and pull them out of creosote. And then with the creosote buckets to make uh, planks, I want to see if I can use this. Um, do I have a, bin of a bench over there? I want to see if I can use up these uh, U planks because I can't use them up for much else. So let's see if we can make the, the treated wood. So to make this treated plank, which we need for a lot of stuff, is, forget, oh, here we go. It's wood wrapped around a creosote bucket. So let's see if this U-log works. Stone rod in there. I don't know what that is for. We'll put it in this uh, bench. Let's see if uh, this works. Oh, great. It does. So I have all these stacks I, I can use up. All right. Get the bucket back. So let's do that. Let's make uh, some more of these. And uh, let's get that bucket back. I imagine we're going to need a lot of these for the windmills and and water wheels. So let's go ahead and uh, do a, a couple more here to make sure we have enough. To uh, go forward and... So we have two more um, groups of eight here. So let's get two more uh, two more buckets of creosote if we if we can ferret here and uh, that should have um, updated a uh, an achievement because we got the creosote. Got the planks here. Let's see. Um, where is it? So the coke oven we made produced both creosote liquid and coke, which we did. Maybe I got to pull it out. Maybe that'll do it. There we go. That was it. Just had to pull it out. Didn't pull it out yet. So that achievement's done. So we should be able to go on to the next which is the windmills and stuff, which shouldn't be too bad. Water wheels and windmills in the blast oven because now we have the creosote wood, right? So let's keep, uh, take some more of this coal. I haven't gone mining in a while, but I have to go do that. Get some more, get some more coal. We'll, sp we'll keep that full. So, um, It'll keep making because I don't know how much of this creosote we'll need or how much uh, coal coke we'll need. I know we need the coal coke to make steel. All right. So, um, whoops, wrong button. Come on. So let's see here. We need to make a workbench. That'll keep us going forward. So what does that take? 
the workbench from engineers workbench we need um, treated planks which we have we need a treated fence and just a crafting table so that should be easy the treated fence I don't know if everything needs to be treated yeah all right so let's make some um, treated sticks which we don't need much of because Well, right now we don't. We just need to make some fence here. Does that do it? Yep, that does it. Okay, so we have the fence. We need a workbench, which is just four. And that's it, right? We just then the rest is just the treated lumber. All right, that should do it. All right, big step forward. Um, I'm just gonna place this out here for right now. And once I decide where I'm gonna put all this stuff, which I think I'm going to either go up the level of this or maybe extend this area out uh, from here. But I'm definitely gonna start going down underneath here. And that's maybe where I'm going to go with the blast furnace and with this Coke oven here. So that way, uh, it kind of keeps everything together, and then I'll, I'll put the workbench over there as well. But right now, I'm just going to put it here. Hopefully, yeah, everything can be activated from it. And so that's a good place for it so while we keep going forward. And I know we have to get a make blueprints or something for this. I was reading the manual. I spent a a little while going through that, uh, so I wasn't too lost because this uh, this mod's a little little new to me. It's really new to me. I, I don't really do much with it in, in uh, previous uh, mod packs. I just avoided it because I just didn't f just didn't like it. I, I really don't like the whole treated wood, the windmill, and water wheel stuff for electricity. I kind of just jumped ahead over to that stuff. I like to get into the more of the nuclear type of stuff. Generations like that. Generators like that. I, I like single block stuff, not all this multi-block uh, stuff here. So anyway, all right, so that filled up that one. That's good. Uh, we need to make a vacuum tube, and I imagine that's going to be with the workbench and a blueprint. So let's, I guess, do some of this stuff here, the windmill. Blast furnace would be a good one, too. And the water wheel. What do you got going on here? So the windmill... I wonder if um, well, I think you got to hook it to something. So you have a windmill. We need eight of these and a iron ingot. So we need planks and sticks. And we need eight of those. So we need twenty-four sticks. Twenty-four blocks which we should have yes we have those but we need 24 sticks that will give us four oops one more Okay, so with that, we should be able to make, I don't know why that does that. I hate that it puts that in there. Just where that button happens to be. So we can make seven. I guess we don't have enough planks. We need eight of these. Oh, did we run out of sticks? That shouldn't have happened. Let's try it again. Oh, I can't make this. I make this right now. There you go. We need an iron, iron ingot. Hopefully, we have one in here. Yes, we do. All right, first windmill. 
and update man we got what three updates this this time around maybe we'll probably go for four so the windmill i do believe even if we read it in this will have to be hooked up to a, a kinetic diamond dynamo to provide power so what does it take to make a dynamo let me see is there anything else we can do with this stuff up here they can make a water wheel probably pretty quickly as well but is that really important? Let's see if we can get a um let's see what a dynamo is. Connect dynamo. That's easy. Redstone and iron, but what is this? So we need copper wire and iron, which is okay, but this copper wire is a stick. Any kind of stick and copper wire. This copper wire is plate and engineer wire cutters. Make the plates with copper and treated stick and iron knife blade. So how is this made? Tinker's construct. So we make the cast. From any kind of stone or anything I guess so I guess that would say we should be able to make the stencil right should be this one maybe yeah okay knife blade pattern and then we should put that in the pattern chest right Um, there we go. That's how you do it. So now we go to the parts builder. So we should be able to take this knife blade thing, make it out of cobblestone, I hope. And we should be able to put this in the gold. Oh, come on. And this should make a uh, stencil a for us. Yep, consume the stone. Now we should be able to make anything we need. And what does it need? It needed uh, wire cutters, right? Needs to be iron. Okay. So if we pour... Make sure I have iron in here, which I do. Pour some iron. There we go. All right, not too bad. We're getting it to work. And then the two treated sticks. So we should be able to make, make this now. All right. So the engineer of wire cutters, which I don't think we need in our hand. Let me put the pattern back in there. Um, copper. Do we have copper plate? Bronze plate. No copper plate. So let's make. We need a, a bunch, I assume. So I guess we can make wood and make 16 of them. Whoops, need the hammer. Where's the hammer? Oh, looks, there it is. So let's put this here like this for quick access. And this should give us plate. Yeah, there we go. So we'll smack these up real quick. Can't wait for a better way of doing this. It's a machine. Is that why I don't have to sit here and do this? This is like one of the things that I get it in the beginning, it should be this way, but once you kind of reach a certain age, or it should be automatic, I don't know, having to flip between 
different modes kind of gets to me a little bit. I feel like I'm just like wasting time or uh, being relatively repetitive, boring, especially for uh, recording purposes, right? All right. So we, have, we should have enough to get us through what we need to get us through. So we should be able to put, I don't know how many we need. So let's just do half. So it was one, wow, that's expensive. One copper plate per wire. I thought it would have been a little, a little bit more than that. So you need four, oh, that makes four of those. And we need eight. So we need, we need to do this twice. So that made four, let's do it again. Made four more. Okay. So we have eight of those and an iron ingot, which I guess I should have grabbed a couple more. And leave them in here. All right. Looking good. We're a little bit of redstone, a few pieces of iron. And I probably should put some of this junk away. Oh, let's, um, put this, my nether adventures at all. Guess I could put some of this stuff back, I guess, I don't know. I have a little bit of room there now. Um, okay, where were we? We were making the Connect Dynamo. Whoops. Oh, redstone. No, I know I have redstone somewhere because I've mined it already during my uh, Twilight Forest runs. Oh yeah, I got a bunch of it. So let's just take this and put this in here. All right, so we're gonna have a dynamo. All right, uh, that wasn't an update. I thought that would be, okay. But, that should allow us now to place this on something. So let's um, let's go up here. I mean, I'm definitely probably not going to leave it here, but whoa, this will make it high enough up so it's out of the way and. Should be clear. So if I stick this here, I'm guessing that's how it would work, right? Let me um, let me do this actually. I guess maybe really what I should do is just try it first and see. Let's see if we uh, put this on here. Yeah, okay, it works. So I didn't, it, it does stick to the side. I didn't have to spin it in some kind of weird way. Well, there we go. Looks pretty awesome from behind, but from the front, it looks pretty good, too. Oh, okay, I imagine, okay, this is the uh, power outlet, probably. Maybe there's one underneath it. Nope, just on top. Okay, but that looks pretty sweet. You're getting closer, right? It's not too bad looking. It's pretty good. Yeah, I might leave it up there. 
Well, I, I don't know, because uh, I'm going to keep growing that, right? So I don't, I don't know. So I'll, I'll put it somewhere, try it out, put it kind of high, and uh, we'll get some power stuff going to uh, to it on the next on the next episode. But this one was pretty good. We got um, we got one of the big purple achievements done, and a few of the blue headed in the right direction and exploring new stuff. I guess we're getting into this uh, immersive. Is it was it yeah, immersive engineering? And away we go, right? All right. Well, it's raining, and uh, this is a good place to call it quits. So, on that note, thanks for watching. Until we meet again, good day. Thank you.